first half we started off slow, but second half the coach group really got us fired up because our coach, Coach Melanson, he's in the hospital right now. He's hurting. So we put it for him. We did this for him. Um, I mean, we're obviously down 14 and 3 at the halftime. Our offensive coordinator, Eddie Melanson, is in the hospital. Actually, he's home now. So at half, we just made some adjustments. We just kept saying, hey, let's just play our game, make our W. You know, at halftime we told them, you got to believe them. It didn't seem like, it seemed like in the beginning they didn't necessarily believe that we could do it. So we told them, you know, believe in yourself, believe in each other, believe in us, and, and we, we can take care of it. And uh, second half was just a different game than the first half. You know, we almost gave Coach Wall a heart attack with those 14 points in the first half, I mean, but we really stepped it up in the second the half. The D set in the locker room, we weren't giving up any points, and we did that. Oh, that was huge. Um, we all got our confidence back. Clearly, I mean, we were a little bit down after going down 14 and three, but then when CJ punched that in, that was huge. Yeah, you know, 24 did a great job for that. He was flying around the field. He was all over the place. So we we're trying. We we're hoping to, you know, maybe have him step with Carl and bring CJ back. And, uh, and CJ ran hard tonight. He came out in the second half, and he just turned it up. You know, turned it up a notch. CJ is awesome. He worked very hard in the offseason. Me and him, we went down to uh, Billy, actually, our trainer, in the offseason. Then we went to Gridiron Training. He runs the ball hard, and you can clearly tell that. It's me and Carl. If team keys on Carl. I do good. If team keys on me, Carl does good. And the line really stepped it up, too. It's always good to be at a team at home, especially on our home turf. And uh, hopefully we can beat Georgetown next.